A good Thursday morning, everyone. I'm John Martin with your Channel 3 Fastcast. Okay, so a man told Chattanooga police officers he fell on a knife on Tuesday, but later admitted he was actually stabbed. Officers later arrested Gwendolyn Calloway in an affidavit. She claims Calloway gave police a fake ID when they came to question her about what happened. Calloway is charged with second degree attempted murder and criminal impersonation. The Tennessee Supreme Court has ruled that cities with their own school systems do not have to share taxes that come from liquor by the drink sales. The ruling comes after five lawsuits by counties that felt like they deserved a portion of those tax dollars. Now, Cleveland City Schools will no longer have to share proceeds with Bradley County Schools. And former President George W. Bush will be a special guest at the Athens Chamber of Commerce next month. The chamber is having a benefit to raise money for a new office on June the 22nd. You might remember their old office was actually destroyed in a fire. If you're interested in going, we have more details inside the WRCB app. All right, take the news with you in the WRCB app and check back with us throughout the day. I'm John Martin. That is your Thursday morning Channel 3 Fastcast.